Hello all, today my group will be presenting our project, Professor Compatibility. Myself, Jake Miller, will be joined with Albert Joseph, Jonathan Schechter, and Mark Yarconi. To begin, there are many websites available for students to assess potential professors' traits, reviews, and ratings before registering for courses. However, these platforms do not provide a methodology for students to assess their compatibility with a given professor given their needs. Our professor compatibility assessment allows students to get matched with a professor based on data from professor rating sites and user preferences. In this presentation, we share a methodology that is both user tested and statistically validated and is created with the intent of improving long term academic success among students. <clears throat> So about 91% of students either use or value professor ratings when selecting future classes. So it is definitely an important topic of discussion. Uh, shown on this slide is the current method a student has to go through to decide a professor for a course. To begin, the student has to make a list of professors based on their course. Then they have to enter professor one into a professor rating website. Then this same student has to subjectively and manually summarize all ratings and reviews and compare them to their own needs. Then this process has to be done over and over again for each site and each professor. Then this same student has to uh, choose themselves which professor is most compatible with them. As you can see, the current professor selection method includes a lot of steps and is almost completely manual. Now I'm going to be talking about our current method of tackling this issue. As can be seen immediately, our new method is much more simple and automated. All a student needs to do is take our compatibility assessment and they'll instantly receive a perfect match with an explanation for this match. And all the student has to do to uh, go on with their course is just select their return professor. As, can you, uh, as you can see, almost completely, it almost completely gets rid of all of the student's manual work to find a compatible professor. Our algorithm also removes outlier reviews such as biased reviews or generally reviews that have no importance to a student's needs or goals. So our main motivation to help students find the right professor for them stems from our needs as students. We wanted to see if our peers felt this way as well. So we conducted a student survey and found that over 98% of students felt that choosing the right professor is important for their academic success. And this all correlates back to you student satisfaction, higher grades, and higher student engagement. Our proposed solution hopes to have this high positive academic impact for students' long-term goals. So the current platforms that are out there currently that students use to analyze professors prior to course registration are Rate My Professor, Reddit, SIRS, and 5.0, a web reg extension. But I wanna emphasize that there's no platform that currently allows students to have a personalized recommendation when selecting a professor that meets their goals and passions. Our platform differentiates ourselves from all these other platforms by analyzing these platforms reviews and aligning it with a compatibility assessment we've created for the user. So to take a look at uh, how our compatibility assessment is analyzing the reviews, let's take a look at a Rate My Professor review. A typical review consists of two things. First, the student written text or review, and the student selected rate my professor key term. In order to minimize bias in our algorithm, we had our algorithm look for what we are calling significant keywords. Significant keywords are defined as syllabus related, non-biased descriptive terms. So that's like textbooks, assignments, grades, attendance, rather than subjective or opinionated information. And when looking at this review as a whole, we wanted to see what contained the most significant keywords for our algorithm? And so we conducted a hypothesis test. Our hypothesis test consisted of 30 trials, and we wanted to test what had more significant keywords, the Rate My Professor terms that the student selected or the review that the student wrote out. And we concluded with over 95% confidence that the Rate My Professor terms had more significant keywords than the reviews themselves. And so that was the significant keywords that were gonna be utilized for our compatibility assessment. So we utilize a few different tools to analyze and understand the keywords that John was just talking about and to form our compatibility assessment scoring. We use parse up to web scrape the keywords from all the websites and find the frequency of them used for the professors and Google Forms to form our compatibility assessment. 
From there, we extracted all the data into Google Sheets and we formed our algorithm to predict the most compatible professor for each student. After that, emails were automated and sent out to the students. And within those emails was additional professor information, including links to their Reddit page, Rate My Professor page, and a bio about the professor. After that, we wanted to test our algorithm. So we came up with a beta compatibility assessment and sent it out to students. We received over 20 responses and we asked each student to share information about their previous professors and courses and if they enjoyed them. Um, we believe that our algorithm was successful if it returned the most compatible professor for the student, um, that if it returned the professor that we believe was most compatible for the student, or if it was within a calculative variance um, of the previous uh, student's professor that they enjoyed taking. We had a success rate of 71%. And even though it was a small sample size, we were satisfied with the results and concluded that we can move forward with our algorithm. If we were to adopt it on a larger scale, um, we would have required 100 responses and for the student to take um, the professor we believe was most compatible for them and we would have validated it at the end of the semester. So once we checked the accuracy of our algorithm, the next step was creating the actual compatibility assessment that we would send out to people. So on the left side, you can see the first question of our Google form compatibility assessment. And it's basically where you enter your course that you plan on taking. Currently, we have over 10 intro courses in our algorithm and over 30 professors that students um, can be matched to. The next few parts of our compatibility assessment involve various questions surrounding professor syllabus related keywords, such as the one here, which has so many papers. And after answering all these questions, generally on a scale of one to three or one to five, students are sent an email with their compatibility assessment results. On the left side here, you can see the first part of the result, which basically says who my most compatible professor is, as well as what percentage compatible I am with this professor. On the right side, you can see some additional information about the professor, such as the Rate My Professor Reviews and the Rutgers University bio. This information can be used by the student to make a more holistic decision on which professor they want to register with. And at the, finally, at the bottom of the result, you can see a little explanation on how our algorithm works so that the student is more convinced about the validity of the algorithm and the accuracy of their professor match. So in terms of project management, Mark and I were working on the assessment and technical applications, while John and Jake were more on web scraping and data analysis. Some of the challenges we faced were time for the validation testing, which we overcame by creating the beta assessment. The next one was bias and reviews. And we realized that by conducting a statistical test, we could reduce bias by focusing on the Rate My Professor terms. And finally, we had a small sample size for our validation testing, which was because most professors change each semester in terms of what courses they teach. So most of the people that we surveyed just didn't take those professors or those courses with them. So in conclusion, we noticed that students have a tremendous amount of difficulty understanding professor reviews and finding the best match for their long-term academic success. Our professor compatibility assessment offers a much more personalized, accurate, and efficient method for professor recommendations that's user-tested and statistically validated. Overall, we've created this unique user experience and we're excited to see how this platform gets used in the future. Thank you for everyone who helped us along the way. We'll now take any questions.